Xfinity presents High School Sports. Welcome to the Baldwin Street Athletic Complex in Hudsonville, Michigan, where tonight it was an East versus West showdown as the Stevenson Titans in town to take on the Hudsonville Eagles and Stevenson with a decisive 10 to 2 victory here tonight. And welcome to the best seat in the house right along the third baseline of Xfinity High School Sports. Along with my partner, Dan Jeffrey, I'm Joe Jason. Thanks for joining us. A one sided affair here today. Both teams needed to get some uh, work out of their pitching today from their starters. Hudsonville did not. They would throw six pitchers in this game, only two for Stevenson, who came a long way, but they get the victory today. Well, they did a good job of getting a lot of players in the game, a non-conference game between two quality teams, number six team, Sterling Heights, Stevenson in the state, and last year's state champions, the Hudsonville Eagles. You got to get kids to play in these non-conference games, and they did get that accomplished They've today. They've got both have double headers tomorrow. Let's take a look at the highlights from this one here today in Hudsonville in the first inning. How about Stevenson? They would get things started. Bobby Griffin got things going with a, a base hit and then a bad throw over to first base. And next thing you know, uh, Run's going to score here on this sacrifice as there's a little miscommunication in the outfield. But Bobby Griffin would score on the sacrifice, and it would be a 1 0 game. And then the eighth inning, or the second inning, is when eight runs were scored. And this is kind of when the wheels came off the bus here for Hudsonville. That's Brandon Williams, Mr. Doubles himself. He had two doubles in this game. That's ground ball up the middle. They did get, get a force play there, but another throwing error, scoring a couple more runs. There would be a number of errors in the second inning, three that would help out this Stevenson team, but the bats were going pretty good too. Some good hits to the opposite field, two in a row there to right field, another sacrifice fly. And every time it seemed to get a runner at third, Stevenson got him in. <laughs> there he is, Williams again with another double in this game. Kid has 12 hits and like seven doubles for the year. Greg McDade with a RBI there, he would wind up scoring a run as well in this inning, and they just kept batting around, and it seemed like this inning would never end. When it was all said and done, 14 Stevenson Titans would come to the plate in the second inning and scoring some runs. Here's a big play right here, a base hit into left field, and more runs being scored here. That was uh, Ryan McCauley, that made it 10 to one. That one gets away right there, and another run scores. Just too many errors. You can't walk and have errors. Here's late in the game. Hudsonville's able to get a couple of base hits. But it wasn't enough. Stevenson with that big eight run second inning wins his ball game 10 to two. So a 10 to two victory here tonight for this team from Stevenson that comes a long way and uh, gets rewarded with the victory. 10 to two your final here today in Hudsonville. For my partner, Dan Jeffrey, I'm Joe Jason. You've been watching Xfinity High School Sports, a presentation of Play On Sports Midwest.